detailed instructions here. Seems pretty sound. First off, we're building the headband. Step one, foam pad into the fabric sleeve. One done. Step two, read this under the foam. Now we read the second metal band through. Oh gosh, it's a bit tight. You need to get this out. Step four, we attach the foam pad to the plastic connector.
the right toward this side. Let's do this other side. Alright, looking good, Mr. Head. This Mentor's Guide is very informative. It includes facts and is packed with details on how these headphones function. Which reminds me, there are many types of speaker drivers depending on the type of headphones you have. Ever inside the headphones produces audio, but not all drivers are the same. And this can have a big effect on how music sounds. There are six different types of drivers and they each use different mechanisms to convert electrical signals into sound waves. Here are some. Dynamic or moving coil, which are the ones we're making today. These are plain and magnetic, and my dad won't let me use these because they're expensive. Hey! We got in-ear, Tesla drivers, the list goes on. The list goes on. Alright, let's go ahead and build these speakers. Alright, so we're going to need this. We need the circle facing towards you. And we're going to need the speaker driver facing the other one. So the speaker's flat. Now we're gonna need now we're gonna need this for that inside this hole here. There we go. Now we're gonna be using this to just screw it there. Now we're going to test the wires. The yellow goes with the red wire. So we're going to put the black to black. Black to black. This is black. There we go. Now we're going to leave the blue one alone. Now that we've finished with the speakers, let's go ahead and attach it to the headband. Let's connect this to a power source. And here it is finished. The DIY stereo headphone set from Kiwiko. The manual recommends that this is for 14 year olds. Personally, I wish this set was more complicated. I would say it's suitable for 9 to 10 year olds. The base is non-existent. Don't expect that to be anything as good as these high-end models. If you want to use these at school or bum around with them, it's really good. If you want to hear the full range of sound, I suggest you should upgrade. Overall, this was a fun experience to make and the headphones sound okay. I'm rating this an 8 out of 10.
You're still here? It's over. Go home. Go. Oh.